How to be an Australian man. But first... Now back to... The first step to be an Australian man is you have to wear thongs and shorts no matter what the weather is like. until it's really, really cold. In which case, you should wear Uggs and joggers. Careful of the Uggs. <laughs> In a photo of our Uggs? Yeah. Good <laughs> 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 A beverage must be carried whenever exploring new environments. <laughs> I'm really starting to understand um, Australian gestures now, traveling with two Australian blokes. Hand gestures should be used to communicate 70% of the time. You must be able to lean on your ute, like the deadly guy you are. Of course be a bit nosy as to what other people are doing around you. It's good to talk about your camping gear. And it's always better if you can park your rig for a sweet group photo. There's nothing better than going for a little explore on some dirt roads. And if you don't like throwing things, well...
hot knife through bar. That's just about perfect. Hey, look at it. It's not like nice and brown. Not any holes in there. <laughs> at all. <laughs> uh, so yeah, I reckon, I reckon that's going to be old enough. Oh, Dave, have a look at that. It's not exactly how you want them. Actually, <laughs> get it up, yeah. Oh, I've even got dessert for us tonight. Oh. The truth is, there's only one thing you really need to be an Australian bloke. You have to enjoy the simple things. I haven't really changed much in prom. <laughs> <laughs> See if it will hurt for both of you. <laughs> and if you don't like throwing things, well... On the birds. <laughs> Come on guys. I'm very excited to be sharing that I'm giving away one of my prints. Yes, it's of a very sad moment. But we're gonna be moving past that and making it a happy thing and making it a giveaway. So all the details are in the description so go check them out if you'd like to enter to win. And I will be announcing who won in the next video, next week's video. Yeah. <laughs>